Welcome friends, in this video, let's discuss about United Nations Environment Program. This UNEP is an agency of the United Nations and its main function is in the area of coordination in environment activities and also in assisting developing countries in implementing environmentally sound policies and practices. So it helps the developing countries in formulating environmentally sound policies and practices thereby moving towards sustainable development way okay and this united nations environment program was in, was established as part of united nations conference on human environment in june 1972 it is also called as stockholm convention and its headquarters is in nairobi kenya along with this headquarters it has six regional offices okay for the unep and this is the logo of the united nations environment program and UNEP is active in various areas related to environment. Okay, the main areas of concern for the UNEP is atmosphere, that is in the area of uh, uh, global warming and climate change, and reducing the greenhouse gases. And in the area of marine and terrestrial ecosystem, it is active in the area of mm, biodiversity conservation, uh, reducing the threats to bi biodiversity. And in the area of environmental governance and green economy, it is assisting the developing countries in formulating eco-friendly policies and programs so these are all the important things it is doing uh, for conserving the ecosystem as well as environment along with that this UNEP has played a significant role in developing international environmental conventions so it is a media it is doing the mediatory role in uh, in signing various international environment convention along with that it is promoting the environmental sciences and information dissemination among the various stakeholders of the environment and it is also illustrating that is providing the practical examples the way those can be implemented in conjugation with policy so th these are all the areas uh, the UNEP is active uh, in the area of environment conservation and interestingly the winner of Miss Earth beauty pageant serves as the spokesperson of UNEP so this is the 2014 winner so she will be uh, spokesperson for the one year okay and Along with these uh, good things about uh, UNEP, it is also involved in establishing new institution, institutions. Recently, along with the World Meteorological Organization, UNEP established an uh, intergovernmental panel on climate change in 1988. This IPCC is acting as the authority in the area of uh, uh, climate change and global warming information system. So, along with that, UNEP is also one of the several implementing agencies for global environment facility so it is one of the several implementing agencies for the global environment facility this is the fund uh, which provide financial assistance uh, to various uh, various projects related to climate change biodiversity envir environment cons conservation and also phasing out of uh, uh, persistent organic pollutants utilization in the developing countries and also uh, uh, projects related to production of ozone layer so this is important uh, uh, public fund uh, which is the largest public fund uh, which is available for funding various environment related projects throughout the world so this is one of the implementing agency the UNEP and another fund that is multilateral fund for implementation of Montreal protocol uh, and it is also a member group of United Nations development group okay so these are all the important uh, activities that UNEP is carrying out in the area of uh, environment along with that UNEP is publishing various uh, summaries reports uh, for assistance to developing countries in policy formulation recently the most important document that is the fifth global environment outlook that is GEO5 assessment is a comprehensive report on environment development and human well-being it provides an analysis and information for policymakers and concerned publics uh, to move towards sustainable development. So various countries uh, can utilize the information provided in this uh, document to formulate policies which are eco-friendly and to move towards a sustainable development way. So these are the things important related to UNEP and UNEP is also active in various climate change related areas. This include a territorial approach to climate change and disaster and conflict management, ecosystem management, environment governance, harmful substances. It is also active in the area of persistent organic pollu pollutants and also it is also active in resource efficiency that is uh, adoption of uh, renewable energy resources thereby reducing uh, threats from the 
global warming gases. So these are all the important activities of the UNEP. So this is it about this. Please like the video and share it on Facebook so that it can reach more people who are preparing uh, for civil service examination and also subscribe to the channel for more updates. Thank you. Thanks for